Now let's take a look at the official guide 2016 DS number 27. According to variable approach method, we can modify the original condition and the question. And the question is asking the slope of the line K. And the slope is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So there are four variables in the equation. And the question states lines K and M are parallel to each other. So there are still four variables and in order to match the number of variables to the equation, we need four equations. The condition one has one equation and the condition two has another equation. So logically, there's high chance that E is going to be our answer choice. So using both the condition one and two at the same time, we have point three and two, and another point negative three and two. However, the question states lines K and M are parallel to each other with normal information. So the answer cannot be unique and the conditions are not sufficient. The correct answer choice is E.